We want to find the slope of a parallel line, but in order to do that, we got to find the slope of the actual line that's there to begin with first. So I'm going to start off by just finding the slope of 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and then 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2. So you have to find the slope of this thing first, and then I'll deal with the parallel slope. So there is my line. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Then I'm going down so it's negative. So the slope of that is negative five over four. Parallel slopes are exactly the same. So it's also negative five over four. And just because I'm going to put the perpendicular slope down too, flip it and change the sign. So it would need to be positive because other fractions are negative. All right, so we're looking for a parallel slope. Got to remember that we need to 